Hey, welcome everyone to another update. This time I'll be talking about some new variations on the gears in the game. There are now two versions of every bevel and crown gear, a high and a low version. The only difference between these two versions is where the gear is positioned along its central collar. So for example, here we have uh, two kinds of gear that are essentially exactly the same. The only difference is that in this case the gear is positioned at the higher end along its collar and this, position, this one's positioned at the lower end along its central collar. And what this effectively gives you is um, a half unit increment as to where you can position the gear along an axle. So let's have a look at that in an example here. So here we have a crown gear and a spur gear. Um, they're the same size, um, so we'll give a one-to-one -one gear ratio. And you can see that working there. But now the cool thing is, without having to reposition the axles or change where things are positioned within the construction, I can switch it over to use the high version of this crown gear. And it's exactly the same as the previous one, it's just that the gear is positioned at the further along the, the, the central collar and further along the axle. And that means it'll now engage with a, a smaller spur gear. And that'll give you a different gear ratio. So again, within the, the same sort of spatial dimensions within the construction, you can achieve different kinds of gear ratios by just switching between the high and low versions of the same gears. The same applies with bevel gears, so here we have uh, one bevel gear engaging with another. And you can see that working there. And again, I can switch these around, so here's another bevel gear that's exactly the same as the other one that was positioned here except for the fact that it's positioned that half unit across like that, which means it'll now engage with a smaller bevel gear on the other axle. And again, we can see that working there. So yeah, it gives you uh, a bit more flexibility in terms of how you can use the different gears with each other. Okay, that's it for now. Thanks for watching.